hello, hello. Well, after watching a lot of the Whitaker committee hearing, the acting attorney general, it makes me wonder, just a quick question here, are all of the House of Representative committee public hearings going to be just a frustrating mess, just a frustrating nothing, where eh, people come and haw, and when you're a lawyer and you're dealing with a witness, you don't ask questions you don't already know the answer to. Well, but a, a lot of these, the people on these committees, they don't have the answers. So they ask, and then they get an answer that isn't very satisfactory, but it isn't, it is what it is. And maybe at some point somebody can figure something out, but is this just going to be how it's going to be? And because there are going to be many, many, many of them, are all of these hearings, especially the public ones, are they going to just all be frustrating and unsatisfying, unproductive? Because I, I understand in general that they say that the the wheel of justice moves slowly, but it grinds finely. But uh, the frustration level will not be good. I mean, we're not expecting it to be law and order, but maybe some people are. That could cause problems, but is it, is it going to get it more exciting? Is it is it going to be more daha kind of moments? Well, these are people who know each other and they've worked together for the most part. So there's a certain amount of decorum in the past. All the things that Democrats were trying to do, all the subpoenas they were trying to send, all the, the requests they were sending were being stonewalled. These are a lot of things, but they're hanging. They're just hanging in the air. It didn't it didn't go anywhere. Reading. Who's in bed with whom? Base of the reading. It's time the secrets came to light. Is what they're looking for. Well, yeah. Swalwell keeps coming up, and then it's Schiff. Swalwell and Schiff. And so many people being called in. So many people. It almost feels like for a time it's almost like watching. It's television that comes out so often you think that it's like, oh my gosh, it's like Judge Judy. Where it's on Monday through Friday and, you know, that sort of thing. So, so many hearings. And they're promising to get to the truth, but it's, it's very small. It's what they're... The movement is, is very slow and small. Ah, it's when they, they get to the hearings that have more to do with the documents and where the money, follow the money kind of stuff. Their, their home environment, they're trying to be judicious, they're trying to make decisions about, okay, which should come first, what should, this should follow that, no, no, let's talk to this person first, let's call that person in later. I got two things for hopes and fears. We're all hoping we can get to the bottom of the corruption so that the country can recover. But it still feels like this is on top. I mean, we, we want some bipartisanship and we want, but no, it's a, the, the corruption is really holding that down. Other people see government. <laughs> the government. And it's slow. Final outcome. This feels like it gets exciting once you have more documents, things people can't refute in Stonewall, things that are more obvious. Oh! That's the corruption. People being upset because they're, they're caught and they're being judged. That's what we're waiting for. All right, so what this is saying is don't despair when you get a bunch of people up there being difficult, unhelpful, unhelpful, difficult. Once you start doing stuff about the money, that's when it's going to get powerful. That's when it's going to get a quote unquote good. All right. So that's, but we've got to wait for that. That's not, that's not yet. 
But once we once we get to that sort of stuff, the Trump properties, uh, what they find after going through the tax records, the paperwork, the underhanded deals, the loans, that's that's where the that's where things are going to get really really dramatic. All right. So don't let these. There is a word. It sounds like it's a rude word, but it's a it's an actual real word. Word. It's a, a pissant, and um, that's what Whitaker is. And don't let this pissant Whitaker get you down. Okay. Um, this nonsense today was nonsense, and no. And there will be others like him. But wait for this. Okay? So hang in there. We're in this together. All right? And thank you so much for watching.